unfair and irresponsible. Here he is. Our failure to act responsibly at the federal level will only open the door to irresponsibility by others. And that includes, for example, the recent efforts in Arizona, which threatened to undermine basic notions of fairness that we cherish as Americans, as well as the trust between police and their communities that is so crucial to keeping us safe. It's unbelievable. I mean, it's unbelievable. We, if we're going to have a president assailing every branch of government and every state law that disagrees with his position, then we're headed for a constitutional crisis here. Al Sharpton, of course, has been sent down to Arizona to soak the uh, fires of uh, fairness and justice as well. It is our moral obligation to stand against this profiling in Arizona just as we stood against it in New Jersey. Make no mistake about it, this is not a fight between minorities. This is a fight for justice and fairness for everyone. Okay. Notice that he feels it necessary to inject that this is not a fight between minorities. Why would you have to mention that? Because he knows full well that the vast majority of African Americans are passionately against illegal immigration. This is not to demonize who are, those who are coming here illegally. I want to make this clear. I have a problem with illegal immigration. But the problem I have, it, the least problem I have, is with the actual illegal immigrant. It's with our government not enforcing our own laws and the businesses. Let's just keep this in proper context. The same can be said for the Hispanics who've come here legally. They, they're not necessarily thrilled that they did it the right way. They sacrificed their time, their money, and their effort. Why would you want to be lumped in with those who break the rules and the law? But they're kind of in a jam because a lot of their family is down in Mexico. I do agree with Al Sharpton that this is a fight for justice and fairness for everyone. Equal justice. America, this is what you have to understand. Equal justice, not social justice. Equal justice of the law demands that lawbreakers not be rewarded for their illegal activity. That instead they be treated like everyone else. Equal justice. If there's a reason to suspect that you're in this country illegally, why wouldn't I ask? Again, Al Sharpton on the Arizona law. Then we will bring people from around the country to Arizona to be freedom walkers. Where we will walk down the streets with no ID and submit ourselves to arrest. What is the difference between us and any Mexican or any Haitian? And the difference is legal citizens as opposed to not legal citizens. Legal and illegal. Rule of law. Citizenship is valuable. Statue of Liberty says, I hold my torch before its golden door. You don't put a golden door on an outhouse. You put it on someplace special. Our citizenship is something to be cherished, and too many of us citizens don't cherish it anymore. We just think we're like everybody else, but we're not. We're not citizens of the world. We're citizens of the United States, at least, at least right now we still are. I'm proud of my citizenship. And I know those who have worked hard for theirs feel the same way. But Sharpton brings up yet another reason for the Arizona law to be adopted federally. Isn't it strange that those that hire illegal immigrants at almost slave wages are not perk walked? We're not seeing anyone being punished for playing low-wage employees against those that are seeking to make a living. They're only perk walking those that are seeking to feed their families. You know, this is, uh, this is one place where Al Sharpton and I agree on. I'd like to see the businesses that are doing this perp walk, but perp walk is dishonest at best. When illegals are rounded up, and they almost never do time, and they're usually not even deported, you know, they're booked, and then they're lost in the system. I haven't seen them perp walked. This discussion needs to be about equal justice under the law. Equal justice, not social justice. And I'll give you more on that next.